Welcome to Dr. Jester Rant, and I'm gonna rant about the stupidity and the hypocrisy surrounding the not Spider-Man game, Spider-Man 2 game. First and foremost, let me go and delve into the hypocrisy here. From Hobby Consolas. If Spider-Man some inclusive language bothers you, find another hobby. If video games are not for you. Oh hell, he it's fine you say that, I mean, you're a bit uh, retarded if you say that, but uh, hey, retard power, hey, retard power, yeah, because you will think that the developers are, you know, pretty much deep into this and that they are very, very uh, secure about the politics in regards to this and they, and they have a spine to stand on. I mean, this the entire thing has more alphabet flags than the American flag in the middle of New York. Oh, but then again, it's New York, so. Mm. Either way, here you you see the swastika Nazi alphabet flag, and then the other flags, and the one that I actually managed to make my the third attempt of recording this, because I keep on saying I kept on saying the wrong word. Which would get me muted um, out of YouTube. So this one is the um, transmission flag. And the other flags I have absolutely no fucking idea what it means. And quite frankly, and I'll be honest with you, I don't give a goddamn fucking shit. Because I am already fucking up until my, well, brain, well, up until here. With this goddamn identity politics nonsense, these people, it seems sexuality is the only personality they've got. But anyway, the idiot here goes on and ranting about how inclusiveness is important and, uh, and how they, they bullied uh, some people behind the Spanish language to add um, certain words, but they still cannot, uh, they still didn't manage to add the E as the gender neutral because that's just raking the spanish language grammar up to the world zoo but then again these people will eventually bully the people responsible for maintaining the spanish language rules it's always like that you can see it on the well in the protests on the pro palestinian side how they are persecuting jews everywhere but here is an example that these companies really have no spine whatsoever or convictions to their beliefs. Here from Bound in Comics, Sony censors alphabet content from Saudi Arabian release of Marvel Spider-Man 2, which is not Spider-Man. Peter Parker's Spider-Man. Miles Morales is Miles Morales. Okay. Right, with that out of the way, you see again this goddamn fucking retarded picture. <sighs> and then you see here. A very good example here yeah, from uh, learning the law tweet it's confirmed spider-man 2 middle this version has removed the alphabet dialogues side missions and all gender spectrum flags are you going to insult me too or accept the corporation see your identity as pure money basically they have no answer they are all a bunch of hypocrites because these companies are trying to pander to the alphabet people because they are the loudest fucking idiots in the goddamn fucking room. So they go on and try to pander to them in the hopes or uh, the idea that they are going to make money out of it. But little do they know that their sales are not as high as it could be because of the stupid identity politics. For instance, I would be interested in this, but uh, it's identity politics left and right. It has too much retarded nonsense into it. So what do I do? Well, I'm skipping the game. I don't give a goddamn fucking shit about it. Especially because it deals more with the not Spider-Man Spider-Man. Hmm. So there is that. And you try to tell the, to the alphabet people, the people defending this, it's that... All these pandering is just nonsense, but uh, I digress. Oh, before I continue, here's a trailer of something very important. I suggest you take a look.
I'm back, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Okay, fine. So here's one example of the of what I'm saying. The first uh, taken from Homecoming Mission, in which Miles Morales must assist one of his classmates at the Brooklyn Vision Academy in asking his boyfriend to Homecoming. God. So much of that shows that the game clearly removed the instance of dialogue wherein the boy at the receiving end of the dance proposal, Lucas, recalls upon seeing a specific movie poster. Oh, that's the movie we saw when we had our first kiss. Mm. Further, according to the exchange between fellow Twitter users, the censored version of Insomniac title still features the side quest, though it rep reportedly changes the boy's relationship from romantic, romantic to strictly platonic, though still keeps their mission any instance of hand-holding. Like I said, these people have little conviction. You tell these idiots, you basically have all their rights in the world, even more than the normal people in the West. What else could you possibly want than full domination? That's basically what they want. And I tell them, go on and do this in the Middle East. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of alphabet people in there who need their rights. And no, I'm not going to do that. And what they do, they become queers for Palestine. And what? How you goddamn fucking shitting me? I I don't get it. Why are you people so goddamn fucking hi hypocritical? Go defend the right of of the alphabet people in the Middle East because I am one hundred percent sure that it is mostly illegal for you to be an alphabet in those regions. I know. No. no. No, no. Mm -mm. <sighs> it's uh, it's disheartening to see how absolutely retarded the entire politics is in regards to this. You go on and try to change, create a mod to actually replace some of these flags with an actual proper flag, like the American flag, and you get censored, called names, and your mod gets pulled down. But you replace other flags with the alphabet, and it's okay. It's okay. Uh, the lack of conviction and the, and all of this is and the hypocrisy is really eating on my brain and I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to even be saying these things on YouTube because YouTube actually is very retarded it seems that uh, for some reason they do manage to get their stuff done including YouTube it's due to retard power for some reason the sheer pure brutality of retardness does have some effect well, on that goddamn fucking hell, have a great fucking night. And remember, YouTube, you can go fuck yourself quite bigly, frankly.